वेलकम टू चैप्टर एट एक्सरसाइज एट पॉइंट वन योर क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन इन क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन इट इज आज फाइंड द एरिया बाउंडेड बाय द कर्व एक्स स्क्वेर इज इक्वल टू फोर वाई एंड द लाइन एक्स इज इक्वल टू फोर वाई माइनस टू वी नो दैट एक्स स्क्वेर इज इक्वल टू फोर वाई देखिए ये आपका पैरा बोला है अपवर्ड यू कैन सी दैट This is your upward parabola passing through the origin. Now we will find out the point of intersection of the line x is equal to four y minus two and the given curve. You can see here x square is equal to four y. Right? We can keep the value of x which is equal to four y minus two. So you have to get the value of four y. Minus two, the whole square is equal to four y. Ya apka ho jayega sixteen y square minus two four za eight eight two ja sixteen y plus four is equal to four y. Now sixteen y square minus twenty y plus four is equal to zero, right? We can get this equation divided by four. The upper will be four y square minus five y plus one is equal to zero. This is four y square minus four y minus y plus one is equal to zero. Then four y we can take common. The upper will be y minus one minus one. Y minus one is equal to zero. So what we get is y minus one. एक bracket में और दूसरे में आपका four y minus one is equal to zero, right? So either y is equal to one or y is equal to one upon four, right? So when Y is equal to one. We can find out the value of x with this. So, your x is equal to four into one minus two. This is equal to two. So, when y is equal to one upon four, x is equal to four into y. The value is one by four minus two. So, this is equal to minus one. राइट सो वी हैव गॉट हियर पॉइंट यू कैन सी हियर एक्स की वैल्यू टू है जब वाई की आपकी वन है सपोज कैन सी दिस वन ये पॉइंट एंड दिस पॉइंट ओके लेट दिस बी ए एंड दिस बी बी ओके नाउ दिस पॉइंट इज योर माइनस वन देखिए x की वैल्यू माइनस वन कब है जब y की वैल्यू वन अपॉन फोर है दैट इज वन बाई फोर एंड योर दिस वैल्यू इज टू वेन एक्स इज इक्वल टू टू वाई इज इक्वल टू वन ओके सो वी गॉट हियर दिस पॉइंट ऑफ इंटरसेक्शन राइट नाउ दिस पॉइंट इज योर माइनस वन एंड दिस इज योर टू ओके ये आपका माइनस वन जीरो हो जाएगा And this will be your two zero. So we are supposed to work out this area. Right? You can see that this is the area which we are supposed to calculate. Right? So you can see here. आप इस फिगर में देख सकते हैं कि जो आपका required area जो आपको calculate करना है that will be the area under the line, which is that line. x is equal to four y minus two minus area under the curve. Okay, now let us work out this. Take it. I'm just taking here the rough one. This is the point. Okay. जब आप एरिया अंडर द लाइन लेंगे तो ये आपकी पूरी एरिया आ जाएगी दिस होल एरिया फ्रॉम द लिमिट माइनस वन टू टू वेन यू सब इट विद द एरिया अंडर द कर्व नो दिस एरिया विल बी 
subtracted and we will get the required area. So in this way we will get it work out. So area, required area, your required area is equal to area under line x is equal to 4y minus 2 minus area under curve x square is equal to 4y okay so we are here with area under the line that is limit will be minus 1 to 2 now we have to write this y in terms of x to ye aapka kitna ho jayega dekhe now this will be x plus 2 upon 4 right ye plus 2 upon 4 and this is with respect to dx minus again minus 1 say 2 this will be x square upon 4 dx now this takes a form 1 upon 4 aap bahar nikal sakte hai ye aapka ho jayega x square upon 2 plus 2x minus 1 say 2 again minus 1 upon 4 can be taken outside this is x cube upon 3 and this is again minus 1 2 keep the values when you keep here 2 this becomes 2 square that is 4 upon 2 that is 2 yaha pe 2 plus 4 minus when you keep here minus 1, this becomes half. And when you keep here, this will be minus 2. Minus 1 upon 4. Again, 8 upon 3. When you keep minus, and one more minus. You can see here, this becomes minus. Again, minus 1 upon 3. Right? So, with this 2 minus, we get it plus. So, this will be plus. So, from here, you can see, 2 plus 4, that is 6, minus, minus, plus, plus 2, that is 8. So, 1 upon 4, 8, minus half, again, minus 1 upon 4, this is 9 upon 3, right? So your 9 upon 3 will be 3. You can see here 8 plus 1 9. 9 upon 3. 3 3 is a 9. Okay. This is 8 upon 3. Plus 1 upon 3. 9 upon 3. Okay. Now this takes the form. Okay. Now this is 1 by 4. Into 15 by 2. Minus. 3 by 4. So we can take the LCM. This is your 8. Right? Yaha pe into 2 karenge. Thiye 15 minus 6. And this is equal to 9 upon 8 square unit. Okay? So your required area is 9 upon 8 square unit. Yaha pe y axis. This is your origin. This is your. So this is how we have work out for the area bounded by the curve x square is equal to 4y and the line x is equal to 4y minus 2. Thank you.